when I saw them happening in the first round of a fight within the first minute and he said oh did your fight finish there and I was like no I've done another two and a half rounds they were like what they said you should have just sat on your stool and never carried on fighting I was like are you mad do you think I'm some pussy how are we feeling about today this is just an this is like a force operation or something so not too bad at Going to get me my ankle surgery done. Couldn't get it done straight away before Christmas. And then, what? Who are you calling her? Hey! Lenny? What's the matter? Yes. All right, boy. But yeah, a lot of people have been saying, oh, why has it took so long? But we had all the book for January and February. I had to go to America, so I couldn't couldn't get it done before and can't fly when you had it done. So getting done today, won't be able to fly for like six weeks. Thank God. So I don't want to go anywhere. When I kicked Jared Gordon on that leg, and he didn't even check it properly, I put it back down and was like, oh shit, this would happen to me in the first round. So it's one of them, I know it's something that needs doing, so I'm just glad to get sorted today. Have you been managing to train in that one? Yeah, I've been getting sessions in while I've been away, I've just got to, I've just got to get on with it, lads, you know what I mean? Like, as you know, my appetite's quite big, so if I don't carry on training, I'll just end up like fat bastard. Get in my belly! No, I'm actually not weighing that much, so there was 90, 92 and a half key yesterday, you know what I mean? 200 pounds ago. That's when I'm fat, I go to 210, you know what I mean? What do you call people who make coffees? Baristas. Barista. I'm a barista now. <laughs> Two. Two. <laughs> and it was by the machine, he didn't even make it. <laughs> How's it feeling? It doesn't hurt that much when I'm just walking around, I'd say like, Eight out of ten at the time, it's time walking around. Where do you feel it? Like there. Yeah. But like sometimes it ends up like affecting the whole foot. Are you training at the moment or have you just taken a complete break since? No, when I was in America I was training. I wasn't training all the time, like but some days I was training. Paddy came to see me after his last fight. That foot man. Yeah, First round. Right. Anything in the hands? Not in my hands, that's my foot. I've got pain in my foot, lad. You could see that he'd torn quite a lot of the major ligaments around the ankle, so we call it a multi-ligamentous sprain. So the ankle wasn't stable and is, is actually tipping when he stands on it. Sometimes that settles down, scar tissue forms and it all tightens up, uh, but in Paddy's case uh, it hasn't done because they were quite high grade sprains, so we're actually going to reconstruct those ligaments today. Yeah. 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 <laughs> that click. Yeah. That shouldn't be happening, should it? No, not so much. No. Okay. And would you be hopeful of full rehabilitation? Absolutely, yeah, yeah, I think it'll be fine. We're actually reinforcing those ligaments with synthetic ligament today, so they will be stronger than what he had before. Yeah, so you're gonna be in the boot for quite a while, and we're gonna to have to put an insole in your shoe for a few weeks as well, and that just kind of offloads that repair that we're doing on the inside, just to make sure that it heals as tight as we can get it. So, as okay. I say, whatever, whatever you recommend, I'm down for. It's just, it's gotta be done, it's one of them things. Will we get something like, you know, imp, imp, like written down or like steps we need to take for his recovery. So he's going to be seen by my physio, my specialist physio Louise, who's a foot and ankle sports rehab yeah. specialist. And she knows exactly what's safe and unsafe at each step and she will tailor it to his sport as well. It might be that Paddy goes a little bit quicker than planned or a little, a little bit slower, slower, you know. But, but just do it kind of, let Louise guide you and try not yeah. to push faster yeah. than Louise. Louise yeah. will crack the whip. Yeah, I'm sure he'll be fine. This is like hers. Fourth operation, so um, yeah, it's not a no, not nervous for him. I just hope his recovery is all right. Is it just part of the lifestyle? Yeah, been with him for the last seven weeks. I'm glad to see the back of him <laughs> and have a few hours on my own. I'm not gonna lie. When I first got here, it was like, Yeah, you'll be on your way home at five. It's ten past seven, and I'm still sitting here. Like, how are you feeling, lad? Come on. I feel sound, there's nothing wrong with me. I took well more recreational drugs than this when I was a stupid kid and walked home. You know what I mean? Walked home like that. I was expecting you to be off your bars. I done woke up normal. I haven't had f all to eat all day. As I say, I'll be honest, I've just woke up in a foul mood when I found out it was half six and I was still sitting here and I wasn't on my couch. How was the leg feel? I can't even really feel it, I'm trying to move my toes now and I can't move them. Mm. You know I mean? said the what's name went on longer than expected, you know that? Must have been if I'm still f***ing sitting here at half seven. It's not their fault, the nurses. 
But when I've just woke up, then I've just been in a terrible mood, lad. Mm. As I say, I looked at my phone and was like, why aren't I in ours? You know what I mean? I should be sitting in ours with my feet up down. Instead, I'm still sitting here. You'll be out of here soon, lad. I hardly feel that. I feel that. I can't really feel that. I'm still here. When I saw them happening in the first round of a fight, within the first minute, and he said, oh, did your fight finish there? And I was like, no, I've done another two and a half rounds. They were like, what? He said, you should have just sat on your stool and never carried on fighting. I was like, are you mad? Do you think I'm some pussy? People were like, oh, Jared Gordon did so well. He only done well because my ankle was fucked. Stupid shit. And he's just being a bitter little girl, going on every interview site. Oh, I won that fight, I won that fight. Well, lad, Joe Selecki beat you, but you got a split decision, so shut your mouth. Would you run it back, lad? Yeah, I'm gonna punch his head in towards the end of the year. I am gonna run it back. I hope he beats Bobby Green, because I'll snap his arm for him in a round. I had a boxing match with him, and I still won, because you're sh I hope he watches this. You're fucking dog sh At my worst, you couldn't beat me at your best. Injured. Everything going wrong. You couldn't beat me on my worst day, and I beat you on your best, because you're a little He's just a charming young man, isn't he? Just want to see what I'm like on the grudges. Oh, right, just be careful because you might still be a bit woozy. He's not. No, I'm far from well, woozy, you me. I get punched in the head for a living, look. <laughs> this is not on this. Okay, just, yeah. Best kind of piss. The best piss, lad. Sit down, wait. No mess, lad. Sit down, wait, no mess. Sometimes it does know when you don't like hold it, and it comes through this gap here. You know, and that's the most annoying thing ever. It happens to me when I'm sitting there on my phone talking and I look down and the bathroom's soaking. I'm like, what the f***? Who is the funniest? Angela Hill. Most annoying. Probably Patty. <laughs> <laughs> Probably Patty. <laughs> Get on that then. I can get the other shoe off with me boot already. Boom. <laughs> All he's done is sleep. We've been sleeping on the couch since Thursday. Not good. He's been vomiting off the painkillers. The first couple of days he barely ate, and now he's got his appetite back now, so I'm mm. gonna go around to my mum's for a nice roast. But yeah, besides that, he's been fine, really. He's been slow, though. Yeah, it's terrible, but it's, it's gone down now, so hopefully he should be all right. To be honest, it's been quite easy. But like, you know, stupid stuff like try on his, go on his crutches with his iPad and it's absolutely fine. But we'll drop his boxes where he stands. Mm, sorry. <laughs> How are you mate? You alright with being on camera? Is that okay? No. Oh, uh, f***ing right. Can't be cash. I'm part of the, I'm part of the actors union mate. <laughs> it's Steven Spielberg, bud. <laughs> yeah, I get it, then. So this is what Paddy needs, really, in a home cooked meals. Get him back to strength. Yeah. Well done, Joni. <laughs> Thank you, John. You'll be. Tell me that when you when you get it. <laughs> Taste test first. How are you feeling, Pad? All right. Appetite not quite there. Like then he'll be needle. Yeah, then he'll be up <laughs> The legs in a big cast, as you can see. It's throbbing right now. It's eating. I'll be in this for another six to ten weeks. So, we'll see what happens. I told you so before, you should know by now. Like, comment, subscribe.